What it do, YouTube? It's your boy JH on that, and I'm back with another video. That's right. So, check it out. This is what we're dealing with today, guys. So, I'm going to show you guys the right way to clean your wheel wells and all and everything else underneath your car. A lot of people like to clean it with it on, but that's not the right way. You need to take the wheel off, put it to the side, and then, you know, get your pressure washer, all your good stuff like that, your brush. The chemicals you go use and get started so we go get this one done we go get that one back there done show you guys why is we back here and then we go get the other side done so if this is your first time here go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit that like button leave me a comment and also hit that notification bell I'll get back with you once I got everything set up all right guys so this is all I'm using right here I'm gonna use this all clean uh, purpose cleaner. And then I got my hose or my uh, pressure washer right there. And then I got my brushes right there. So let's go ahead and get started. What we gonna do first is move this stuff out the way. And then we gonna take our hose and just go ahead and start. Get all the loose dirt everywhere. I don't know if I'm doing a good job of filming, but I'm trying my best. Alright. Once that's done, then we go take our spray bottle. And we go start over here first. Just go spray. Let it sit for a little bit. Just like that. And it need to work, so we go let it sit for a little bit, just a little bit. And then we'll take our brush, then we'll start scrubbing. This one needs some more pans in it, of course, but we'll probably fix that. Right now, we just trying to get it clean. And I got some more buttons I could throw up on here, so that's no biggie. Just like that, and then we go do this side right here. Spray that. Same thing. All right, you guys get the picture. Let me go ahead and finish up real quick and I'll turn this thing back on. All right, guys, so we gonna let this dry. Once this dry, I'm gonna hit it with some uh, dressing and uh, we go put the tires back on. So for right now, let's get this tire done. I just wrenched it off the front and back. I'm not gonna uh, wash the back cause I'm not, but the front I am. So we go spray it. And we go do the same thing, get the brush and repeat. Get back with you in a little bit. All right guys, so this is the end result right here. So, yes sir. I know I probably could have got in that corner a little better, but hey, it is what it is. And down there in the bars, I could have did a little better, but I wasn't really tripping on that. I, I just wanted the wheel well to look really good, and which they do. So now it's time to put the wheel back on, which look even better too. Check it out. Check out the wheel before. Check it out. So yeah, so let's go ahead and get this wrapped up. I'm gonna go ahead and get this back done and I'll turn this thing back on a little bit. All right guys, so this is the last tire right here and the last wheel well. So we gonna go ahead and get this done. And once everything's done, we'll pull this thing out in the sun so you guys can really see how it look. Get back with you in a little bit. I'm gonna also let you guys see more of the process on this last one. So I'll get back with you in a little bit. All right guys, got the tire off. So it's nasty up in there. So all my stuff that I'm going to use is right here. So here we go, finna get started.
All right, guys, and here it look without any dressing on it. Just how it looks, just clean. You know, so I'm gonna go ahead and spray some dressing on it, and then that'll be that. Put the tire back on, and I'll turn this thing back on. All right, you guys ready to see it? As you can see, I'm mad soaked. It's 105 out here, but I'm gonna show you how, I, show you guys how it look. The tires got a little dirty because, you know, we rolled out, but it's all good. But I bet you can't see no dirt in the wheel wells, though. You might see some dirt on the wheels. Yes, sir. Let me know what you guys think, man. Like I said, there's dirt on the wheels, but there's no dirt on the wheel wells. Let me show you guys. So... Yes, sir. All right, guys, so here's all the dirt. As you can see, that's why the when I rolled out all the dirt, I gotta get all this up. But yeah, silky. So all right, guys, so it's time to take this thing to the shop. And um, my um, mechanic, he gonna go over everything, make sure everything is good. Once it come out the um, mechanic shop, we'll take it, go through it, get emissions. Once it's getting emissions, we'll uh, go ahead and detail the whole car right now. And then when we detail the car, we ain't got to take the tires back off. We can just use the extended, extended brush and get under the wheel wells. I'll show you guys once that comes. But I just wanted to show you guys how it looked. Show you one more time. Because it was filthy at first. You guys saw it. Yes, sir. All right, I ain't gonna walk around the whole car. Um, I'll get back with you guys once we get to the shop. All right, guys, it never fails. Every time I wash something or do something like that, it starts to be a dust storm and it starts to get ready to rain. Look how nasty it is out there, guys. Look at the sky. It's all dark. Man, it's about to do something really, really nasty. Mm -mm -mm. But anyway, we are about to get ready to head to the shop, as I was telling y'all, and um, leave it over there for a little bit. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna be dirty again. So, at least we got the most of the dirt out the way. So when we get it back, all we gotta do is just really clean it and um, go get it, um, like I said, go get emissions done for it. And then wait for the title. And uh, let's get this thing sold. So that's the plan, man. Um, I'll get back with you guys once we drop this car off though. Cause like I said, it's nasty out here. And I wanna pay attention to the road and make sure that nothing fly out. Cause as you guys can see, everything's flying, dust and stuff flying, stuff flying over. So yeah, I'll get back with you in a little bit. Sorry guys, so I guess I'm not going to the shop today. He called me back and said that it was nasty outside. So he wanted to get home. And like I was telling you guys, it is nasty out here. So. Uh, we'll have to uh, continue this video. Well, I'm gonna end this video, but we'll pick it back up tomorrow. Uh, once, you know, the weather uh, calm down a little bit. So, with that being said, guys. Oh yeah, uh, I got an update on the Crown Vic. It will, it's, I ain't gonna say it will. It should be done on Friday, but I'm gonna say Saturday, just to give him one more day. You know what I mean? Cause, like I said, he is doing a lot of stuff to it, so. And I did um, go over there the other day, so he is working on the other side. So um, hopefully he'll have that done by today or tomorrow. Um, with everything put together, and then he can start on the uh, back end. So, all right, guys. So I'll see you guys tomorrow once I get this thing taken to him. And uh, I don't know if I'm gonna make a video tomorrow, but whenever I do make the video, I gotta give me another visor too. But whenever I do make another video, I definitely turn this thing back on. Um, I do got to get a, take the car to him, so we'll see what happened with that. But until then, man, it's your boy JHO now. Ch it's your boy JHO now. I'm sorry. Checking out with another video. Peace.